please understand the government printing all this money is not necessarily a good thing because this leads to inflation. Inflation is caused when you have more dollars in surplus, so that means that each individual dollar is worth less than it was previously before all this money was printed. So this means your purchasing power is less than it was prior to all this money that was printed. So this is why you could buy one thing 20 years ago that might have cost you $5, now it might cost you $20 or $25 due to inflation. Hey dad, why is it important for young people to know about investing? Well, listen, you've got time on your side. Investing is all about time. So Albert Einstein, among all the things that he came up with, he came up with compound interest. So you gotta know the rule of 72. Take 72, divide it by the interest rate you get it and that, that you get, that'll tell you when how fast your money doubles. All right, so if you get a 6% interest rate, every 12 years, your money will double. If you're 20 years old, it doubles at 32, it doubles at 44, it doubles at 56, it doubles at 68. In other words, you can you can retire a millionaire by only putting a little bit of money away. The big thing is right now you're thinking about what can I do to work for money? Investing gets your money to work for you and you have time on your side. You're not an old fart like me, you're like her. Put a little bit of money away now, you'll be rich later. At 20, if you invest $20 per week, you will have over $900,000 by the time you're 65. But if you start 10 years later at 30, you would need $55 per week. And if you start at 50, you would need $510 per week. This is why investing early is more important than how much money we invest. Like and follow for more tips. You know, if you're just a consumer of them, you're not getting into the joy, right? But when you can become part owner of these corporations and as they do good and they launch a new product that does amazing and a new service and that stock price goes up, you get to participate in that. And that is the beautiful thing about the stock market. What's something that you wish you knew earlier about money? I'll go first. Most people actually don't become rich by holding all their cash in a savings account. And that's because of inflation. $10 today buys a lot less than it did 10 years ago. And $10 in 10 years time will buy a lot less than it does today. Every single year, our money loses about 2% of its buying power because of inflation. And that's why investing is so important. Yes, investing does have a lot of risks associated with it. But if you do your research and you know what you're investing in and you have a proper strategy in place, it can help you build a lot of wealth over the long term. Like and follow for more tips. If you're not ma managing money correctly when you have a little, why are you going to manage money correctly when you have a lot? The reality is, you're not going to. It, the country's not going to go away. The plants aren't going to go away. The people aren't going to go away. The talents aren't going to go away. The, the, the country will grow in value over time. Now, who gets it is another question, but, but it'll grow in value. And if it grows in value, businesses will grow in value. So it's a terrible mistake to buy or sell stocks based on what you think business is going to do next month or next, uh, ne even next year. Okay, so investing is important for me for many different reasons, but I kind of break it down. There's the financial side and then there's the personal side of investing. So on the financial side, the first thing I think about is pensions. Um, you know, you may have a pension from work, you may not, but I think we all need to put money aside in order to make it grow so that one day we create our own pension where you can take income from your assets to pay for all your living expenses. So that's uh, probably one of the biggest uh, reasons why you need to invest. Also, um, we gotta be aware of inflation, right? Inflation generally is about two to 3% every year. And this year it's probably closer to seven to 10% because of the worldwide sickness. So it's important to invest to stay ahead of inflation because our money is becoming worth less and less every year. And then, you know, we don't really have other options than to invest our money because we can't just stick it in the bank account into a savings account because uh, if we do that, we're gonna get, you know, pretty much 0% or a half of a percent. So it's, it's worthless to do that. Okay, so on the personal side, you know, I'm also a big believer in, um, you know, uh, being self-reliant and being able to take care of yourself. So investing is important because it will provide you the funds uh, to pay for all your bills, to pay for your, your rent, your food, your car, your transportation, that sort of thing. And, um, you know, and then you don't have to be dependent on other people. So uh, by investing, you can work towards becoming financially independent. And that basically just means you have a bunch of assets that uh, kick off income that you can pay all your expenses with. So. Um, and then once you become financially independent, you have the freedom 
to do the things you want to do, right? You can work at the companies you want to work with, or you can start your own business. You could also have more free time to spend with your family and, and your loved ones. And you also have the free time to go after and pursue the, the things you are passionate about, right? Maybe it's, uh, you know, maybe it's mountain climbing or traveling or sports or whatever it may be. You just have more time in order to do that. So those are, those are some important reasons. And then finally, the last thing I think about um, is philanthropy, right? I think it's good, you know, when we're younger, we're the, when you're a younger person, you may not have a lot of money, but you can invest your time. You can invest uh, your thoughts and your ideas to different charities to, to help out. And then as you get older and you're making a bit more money, uh, you can you can make some donations to uh, some different causes you believe in uh, in order to help out people you know that aren't as fortunate as us okay so those are those are really the big reasons why I think investing is important and uh, if you like the content just hit subscribe and uh, we'll see you on the next video